Will Hall is the new head coach of the Southern Miss Golden Eagles, and I, love this dude. I am shocked at this number. Five and a half is okay. the win total here. Okay. To go over That's, that didn't shock me. To go over is plus one fifty. <laughs> okay, that, now I'm shocked. All right, right? now okay, uh, yeah, I was about to say that's where I probably would have the win total. To I go under is like minus one thirty-five. Just gonna keep getting caught with my hand in the cookie jar. Well, all right, so here's the deal. what was the I, under? The under is minus one thirty-five. That's a lot of juice. Uh, I trust Will Hall a lot a, a, with his offenses. Um, you know, Trey Lowe, the quarterback, running back Frank Gore. Uh, they've got a dynamic wide receiver core. Southern Miss does have talent. The defense returns 10 starters. They gave up 402 yards per game last year. They gave up over 30 points per game last year. I am not sure what to make of them because they are more talented than what they showed last year. So, normally um, I would say I I want a team getting a new coach to have a little bit of a feeling out, a little bit of uh, being comfortable in a new system. This is a team that had three head coaches in one weird-ass COVID year last year. Yes. Okay. So this is their fourth that, head coach in uh, – <laughs> In less than a calendar year. Yes. During a 10-game scheduled season, they went through three coaches. And still found a way to win three games. And three still, and yeah, and still won three games. I think Will Hall with a full offseason, I think there's talent at Southern Miss. Yeah. yeah. There, there just is. SP Plus has them at 6-6. Six and six. Along with FPI, both at going six and six. Yeah, so I, I thought I didn't think it was good. When you said five and a half was a number, I was like, yeah, that sounds right. Five, six. I think their ceiling is seven wins. If if they catch fire, I think their floor is five wins. So they are projected favorites in six games. Yeah. That that makes that all makes sense to me. I think Will Hall is a really, really good coach. I love him getting this chance. I I love the over. Man, the juice scares me because that's I'm I'm gonna take the under. I'm gonna take the under. You're gonna take the under. Yeah. Where do you I think, think they're getting tripped up? I think they can lose at home to North Texas. Uh not they, that we just want to go through the schedule, but no, I, I I don't think that they'll beat UTSA. I don't know if they can beat uh Louisiana Tech. Uh I think that they could get well, they'll probably get caught by Troy. Uh, they play Alabama. They play at Rice. I mean, it's, this is a tough schedule, man. It is like, a tough schedule. This is a team that I I just think I think they're good. And and we love Will Hall, so it you know and I do and I but I, I but I'm biased and you know that and I'm I'm very honest about my biases. If I really like a coach, I'm I'm gonna go in on him. So you're gonna go over five and a half. Yeah, and I'm gonna love all that juice plus one fifty, plus one fifty. All right. If I get that one right, I can lose half another one. I'll be fine. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com. And if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.